I haven't really had a chance to study the stat sheet, and I'll get to that later. Uh, to me, um, they did a great job, and they made more plays than we did. And, and it, it's bewildering to me that we're having trouble challenging shots. And um, I'm not sure what the numbers are, but there are too many times we didn't get a hand up there. <coughs> and uh, whether we were man or whether we were zone, we had to do some things to get the penetration stopped. But, but we didn't challenge shots enough, and then we made some turnovers that we just can't make. And, and the, the hardest thing to get into, across to any team, but especially when you get into league play where, where it's magnified so much is the mental errors. And we had too many of them tonight, and, and, and far too many. And, and, the, and, the, and there's a list of them, and, and we've got to get, get out of it. Uh, we've got to continue to understand how to not make the game hard for ourselves. Um, that we made some plays that looked like it was our first game. And in our first game, we actually played really, really well. So it, it's just a matter of understanding uh, how simple we have to make the game, whether it's taking one more dribble, whether it's taking one less dribble, whether it's driving it all the way through the paint. And uh, some of the mistakes we made tonight were out of unselfishness. Uh, guys passed up shots. I mean, one stands out, OG's wide open, Jawan turns, he, he throws a drop-off pass, Jawan is ready to rebound the ball. I mean, it makes no sense. And um, we've got to just tighten up. So, so I'm clear on that. I don't need to see the stat sheet to know that. We'll get into the film. And uh, told them get, get a, it's going to be a short night for them because we'll be back getting it figured out uh, tomorrow and getting ready for what will be an incredible battle for us on Saturday with Louisville. Go ahead. Uh, yeah, it seems to be a bruise. It, it seemed uh, he was in a lot of pain. I think we were all extremely fearful when that happened. And um, frankly, I've not seen him in that. I, I don't remember being in that kind of pain when the shoulder went out a year ago. So obviously we we're fearful of that, but it looks to be a bruise. He'll continue to uh, get it evaluated tonight and worked on. And uh, I can't give you any more of an update than that other than that it was not a uh, – it, 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 it certainly didn't appear at this point to be anything – um, I mean, it's a tough bruise, right, when you go down like that, but it doesn't appear to be anything that, that um, would be overly serious. You talked, uh, you talked yesterday about, about you had seven guys that never played in a big mm. game before, but it seemed like the veterans were having as much trouble. Oh, but that one of those veterans is, is Josh Newkirk. Right. I mean, yeah. I mean, James Blackman didn't play in the Big Ten game last year. Yeah, we, we um, it, it, again, it, I don't know if it's that we can't have the mental errors. You know, I, I'm not sure with those mental errors, it would have mattered who we were playing. And they played excellent. They played excellent. I mean, we, we knew they're uh, um, they are very aggressive on the backboards. They want to get to the basket. Um, um, they're shooting. They made some shots. They made shots because they got some rhythm because we just didn't get hands up, which is beyond baffling because now the Butler game was the same type of thing. So um, granted we have, everybody has issues from time to time in their ball screen coverage or their, or their post defense or their ball pressure or their switching. Everybody goes through that, but there should not be an inordinate amount of missed shot challenges. So it doesn't have anything to do with experience, lack of experience, the hands have got to go up. Just go ahead, go ahead. Yeah, I don't know, Jeff. I haven't. I don't have the luxury of being able to sit there and watch the game from the big screen. So I, I, I don't know if it's effort. I haven't seen the film, and I haven't really read the stat sheet. I'm telling you what I think. So I'm sure I'll find some things when I get in the film. It's really, I mean, I, I, I don't have the vantage point that you have of the film. All right. And, and um, um, go ahead. I mean, you might have some other points there. I mean, with it. Oh, no, I don't think we got beat on effort. I, I don't think we got beat on effort. I, I, I mean, but my, my general opinion, I may change it tomorrow. I'm not going to tell you, okay? But, but um, I, don't, I don't feel like that. I, I feel like we made some mental errors. And uh, I feel like at times we were trying to do too much, you know, to, to get the ball to people. So you're, you're, you're pointing out a couple things. I mean, um, I, I don't think we've had too many teams at Indiana that have gotten beat on effort. Do you? No. No, so I wouldn't assume that tonight is, I wouldn't assume tonight is one of those cases. If we got beat on effort, the way as hard as they were playing, we'd have got blown out by 30. It was a close game all the way down to the wire. They played really hard. We just didn't play as well. Uh, Coach, how tough is it in the second half without Robin there to foul trouble 
No, that hurt us. Yeah, that hurt us because uh, uh, we really we really realized in that situation how much how good Rob is. Um, I had a pretty good idea how good Rob is, but uh, but playing without him for that long stretch tonight, I got a real indication of how good he is and how much we missed him. And he's a stabilizing force for us. And um, and then he came back into the game a little bit. He made some shots, but he tried to get into the gaps and lane and in. You know, that, that's not what our game is right now. Our game is drive and kick. If there's a clear path to the basket, let's take it. You know, there, there's, there's, there's mistakes we made tonight in the game that, that um, uh, will get corrected, you know, with, with when we shot, when we didn't drive, you know, those type of things. We, we had the, vantage, the advantage of being in the double bonus early, and there were a couple of times we didn't take advantage of that. Now, is that effort? No, that's more of just, that's just more not understanding what the game is giving us. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. He and, he and Watson do a great job of getting downhill. And, um, and our ball screen coverage, it wasn't the bigs as much as it was the guards not getting back up into the ball. And, um, and we can't have that. And, and our zone, they made a couple shots uh, in it, but there was a time our zone was doing a really good job for us. And, um, but we learned some things in the game. We went to the switching and things of like that. The game's always giving you something, and then when you get back and read or watch the film, it's teaching you something. And uh, I'm real comfortable being in an environment like this. I'm real comfortable when you hit adversity. I'm good with that. So we'll just figure out how to overcome it, and I have no doubt about that. And um, uh, uh, we'll find out who's, uh, who, can, who, can, who can learn the same thing. It's one game.